I don't have to tell you about UK weather because everyone everywhere talks about how awful it is all the time. But there's usually one week a year which makes living in London completely worth it. The only issue is, because it's so limited, you really feel the pressure to make the most of the summer. Luckily, I have this week off, which means I really have to seize the moment. Which means I actually left my home every day for a week.
be completely frank, I get quite emotional simply walking around London. London is so established, so ingrained in influencing global arts and culture for decades, even centuries, and one cannot help but think, who might have walked down the same streets that you walk on? London has been home to so many literary giants that I made it my mission to use 101 Dalmatians as my Tuesday outing. 101 Dalmatians was a children's book written by Dodie Smith in 1956 and then turned into the iconic Disney movie in 1961. Dodie lived in Marylebone with her nine Dalmatians and often would be seen walking them in Regent's Park, allegedly the house that Roger and Anita lived in, in the book version that is, is actually right across the road from Primrose Hill, where the iconic Twilight Bark was set and right by Regent's Park.